misuse and schizophrenia. Now, I wanna start with the most important thing, and that is that there is no evidence at all that cannabis use alone can cause schizophrenia. There is absolutely a genetic component here that cannot be ignored. The main accepted theory at this point is that there is a genetically susceptible population of people, and these gene mutations that they have make them more likely to overuse cannabis and more likely to develop psychotic conditions. Now, this is a poorly understood and difficult topic to research, but what we know is that people with schizophrenia tend to use cannabis products. However, the overwhelming majority of people who use cannabis products will never develop any sort of psychotic disorder. Numerous studies have found that increases in the population-wide use of cannabis has not been associated with increases in the psychotic disorders within the population, which has been pretty stable over time. What has been found is that the use of cannabis with people with schizophrenia could potentially lower the age in which they first experience the symptoms of that condition. But again, it is not causing it. The genetic predisposition is already there. It's just bringing out those conditions earlier than what that person might have experienced otherwise. Lastly, consistent use of very high THC cannabis products can increase the likelihood of a negative mental health episode which is why most educators are advocating for more balanced formulations in general. We should not be shopping for only high THC products. But I wanna remind you a similar trend can be seen with alcohol if you're only drinking Everclear and same thing with caffeine if you're only ever drinking eight shots of espresso. Too much of anything is absolutely bad for you. Education is harm reduction and cannabis does not cause schizophrenia.